Hi, I'm Amber Marsala with SCN Corporate Connect. We're here today in San Francisco at the World Crypto Economic Forum. I'm here now with Henry Inez from Chavon. Henry, tell us a little bit about your company. Absolutely. So, so what is Project Chavon? You know, Chavon, in essence, represents the future of healthcare, and really more specifically, um, personalized healthcare. So, you know, like everybody knows, healthcare is broken, right? So, when you look at the drug discovery process. It's lengthy, it's expensive, um, data, it's not properly secured, right. and it's siloed. So, you know, this really has a lot of implications in terms of um, R&D processes and, you know, for clinical trials. And in many instances, uh, you know, the conclusions and findings are perhaps not as precise as they could be. So, okay. you know, w what we feel about this is that basically it has, uh, causes a lot of implications for patients, you know, because it affects how much we pay, right, for... Right for healthcare and for drugs, right? Mm -hmm. And in many instances, these drugs are, for lack of better words, sort of a one size fits all and, okay. and perhaps not of particular use for you and I and not very targeted. So right. we are obviously you know, on a mission here to try to uh, create a, a platform that is gonna be very beneficial to solve and tackle a lot of these, a lot of these issues. And um, you know, when you look at uh, uh, the healthcare process right now, um, th there's a lot of issues, right? And so, um, yeah, at the end of the day, it, it's, it's uh, costly, right? It, it's, um, it's, it's inefficient. Mm -hmm. And as a patient, it lacks a lot of the transparency and control uh, of data that we require. And at the end of the day, it does not uh, effectively address our, our personal issues, right? Um, right. Our he personal health issues. So, yeah. so we are gonna tackle all these issues and more and specifically try to usher in the era of personalized healthcare. And uh, we're gonna do that by creating the world's largest genomic database and healthcare services platform on wow. the blockchain. And so our, our, our uh, platform will, will offer end-to-end -end healthcare services. And of course, this will include uh, direct-to-consumer uh, genetic uh, genome sequencing, mm -hmm. uh, which will provide a tremendous, a tremendous wealth of information about our health, um, will help in terms of um, how we uh, uh, tackle preventative care and okay. treatment. And you know, at the end of the day, it's gonna give us choices. You know? So choices in terms of, uh, do I wanna donate my genomes for research? Do I wanna monetize on it? Wow. And really control about uh, who has access to all of my data, which at the moment right now, specifically when talking about genome sequencing, is a problem. Because yeah. we know a lot of uh, third parties are, are monetizing on it. So, so, you know, at Chavon, at the end of the day, we believe is about democratizing genome sequencing for all. Okay. And we're going to do that and uh, will help us to get to and all of us collectively towards precision medicine. And we think Chavon is going to play a huge role in it. That sounds great. So how long have you been in this space and how did you get involved? Yeah, so, so it's interesting. Um, you know, uh, for bulk of my career, I've been in uh, management consulting side, investment banking, corporate finance. And really the past 10 years, I've been in the venture capital space. So okay. it, it's nice because obviously we get to work with wonderful entrepreneurs um, and we get to invest in great technologies and at the end of the day tackle the world's greatest problems. Yeah. And what really attracted me to Chavon was really essentially what we're doing. We're talking about healthcare and it's a problem that affects everybody, mm -hmm. right? So um, when I, uh, you know, last year I, I had, you know, we focused a lot on FinTech and blockchain. I had been involved in the ICO space quite a bit. And when this project in particular was brought to my attention, right away I knew this is the project I wanted to be a part of. That's great. And uh, you know, if we accomplish everything, uh, you know, the mission and what the team is aspiring to do, I believe we're going to have tremendous impact um, and positive social impact for for the world, especially obviously in the, in the healthcare field. Absolutely. Yeah. So, how is Shavom utilizing the blockchain technology? Sure. So, so blockchain is going to play a very critical role uh, at, for the future of healthcare. So, first, we're going to move away from a, sort of a centralized database and move towards more of a decentralized architecture. Right. Um, this is going to be very important because, uh, as as it is right now, one of the greater problems for healthcare is that data um, is very siloed. Mm -hmm. So, um, the blockchain is going to help unlock some of this data and make it more uh, freely to be able to use, uh, you know, and have more uniform formats. Yeah. And this will allow drug discovery to be much more efficient. Um, but, but as important is that blockchain gives us very good security. So as I mentioned earlier, um, data 
security is an issue when it comes to healthcare. Mm -hmm. In a blockchain on our platform, we're going to be able to secure the data, we're going to be able to anonymize it. And this is going to be very important in terms of being able to use that data across borders, right. but also to give our contributors and our, uh, the people that utilize our platform the comfort to be able to utilize the products and the services. And, and the last piece, of course, because it's blockchain, um, we can use smart contracts and tokens to basically be able to deploy and utilize all the products and services that will be on Chivom's platform. Wow, sounds like there's a lot of potential for that. Absolutely. Yeah, that's yeah. great. So I know you have an upcoming ICO. Can you talk about that? Sure, absolutely. So our, uh, our public ICO is scheduled basically for the first week of March. And uh, currently uh, we're doing our private sale and we'll begin our uh, pre-sale around mid-February. So okay. we have a tremendous amount of traction and momentum and uh, happy to uh, speak with anybody if they're interested in learning about it. And, and again, my, my, my email is uh, henry at Chivom, S-H-I-V-O-M dot I-O. So, okay, great. Yeah. And how has this conference been for you overall? It's, it's been a great conference and uh, you know at the end of the day it's, it, it's sort of a, a small community here. You, you bump into a lot of the familiar faces. Of so. course. Um, I've seen a lot of people both uh, from you know my VC experiences and also of course on the blockchain fintech side so uh, obviously it's a space that people are very excited about and there's so many great and talented people uh, in the Bay Area and of course people are traveling from everywhere to come attend yep. this conference as well so I think it's a great event and uh, I look forward to seeing a lot of people in future events as well. That's so. great. Well best of luck to you Henry. Thanks so much great, for talking Amber. with us. Thank you so much. I'm Amber Marsala and you're watching SCN Corporate Connect.